Hey guys, it's Terry Dwayne Ashford and I'm appealing to you today in this particular video. It's going to be a YouTube video actually. It's going to comfort, uh, go along with the other programs that I've, I've done. But what I want to share with you is that amidst all of this, you have the, uh, as I've alleged, an attack from the black community and a, conspir a conspiracy by the wider community to try to force me with black people that I don't agree with. One, let me go ahead and make it very clear to you on the record right now. I'm not fat because I work out. I believe in health, living healthy. I do not believe in looking up in the face of or marrying people who are like overweight. Although I do respect those people. I respect people have the rights to live how they want to live. But you also have to learn how to respect people. If you get mad every time somebody say the word fat around you, then you might be doing something that you need to fix yourself. It has nothing at all to do with me. What I'm sharing with you is that you have people running around here carrying out and sabotaging people's lives, literally killing people, literally killing people, laughing about it like it's something funny in a political gang. We call it politics. But we're fixing it for you. This particular YouTube is going to be worldwide on the pimple right there. This particular YouTube is gonna be worldwide and I'm making sure that everybody knows I, Terry Dwayne Asher, was attacked by the black community and was that attack was assisted by the white community who tried to force me with into car seat uh, with a, a black person. Guess who they tried to, what they tried to force me with? They tried to force me with 300, 400 pound women. 300, 400 pound men What's wrong with you when I done told you that's not how I live? Well, it comes from the arrogance and the envy and the jealousy. You see, it all started with the black brother being jealous. Jealous of in the car seat, that guy Terry Dwayne Ashford. They're trying to force Terry Dwayne Ashford with exactly that, which he doesn't want. Well, we're placing, we're putting it out there for the world to see for you. Next time you try it, you gotta understand what's in it for you. I do believe that there should be a World War III over this because of what they've done. They've endangered people's lives. They've actually killed people. They were willing to kill Linda car seat, that guy Terry Dwayne Ashford, whose life, as of today, June 19th, feels endangered. They sabotaged my jobs and all of that. Well, look, <sighs> you know, I can't remember the poet that said it, but she said you should suffer in silence. But well, I do believe that. I've lived that a lot of my, uh, for the most part of my life. However, there are times when you should, when your suffrage is not at the cause and you kind of have waited for them to fix your, fix this shit. We've waited for you to fix it. Doesn't look like you have the class to fix it. Doesn't look like you have the fucking sense to fix it. So we're gonna have to fix it for you. Now, there's no anger in that. What's in it? is we won't resolve. We want you to pull back. We want the whites to pull back. We want the blacks to pull back. We want the shit fixed. That's what we want. And we're willing to do a World War III on it. We do believe that there should be a World War III, part three to the world wars on this. Because what we're seeing here is that this is really simply a fight between good and bad. It's really a fight between classes, a clash of classes. You should see what they want you to live with, live around. You see why? You want to know why? You want me to live around it from revenge. The blacks got jealous. I know whites want it, what I have in my brains. And there is your conspiracy. On that premise, that's why we are world. We're on YouTube right now. It is also the reason why <laughs> reason why we have a right to make our choices based on us. We haven't heard anyone. You're just jealous. Get over your shit. Terry Ashford.